terror on a takeoff at LAX. The engine of a jumbo jet starts spitting out flames, and cell phone video catches it all. Well, hundreds of people were on the packed plane bound from Manila when the engine apparently flamed out. And tonight we're seeing some pretty incredible video from the air and the ground, capturing those frightening moments of that fire. Jeff Nguyen, live at LAX tonight with more. Jeff and Susie, earlier hundreds of people were in line here following that emergency landing. They were at that ticket counter trying to rebook their plans. Tonight, some are on their way, while others are still stuck in town waiting to continue their plans. Look how high we are, Mally. You can see flashes of light streaking across little Mally's face when her dad, Adam Taylor from Long Beach, decided to peek out the window. At first, he thought this was something like backfire out of a race car exhaust. And then it happened several more times, and the loud bangs and, and kind of the jostle of the plane. I'm like, that's not right. In fact, things were not right. Philippine Airlines says Flight 113 experienced a technical problem soon after takeoff from LAX. Mayday, 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 Philippine 113. We have an engine surge on the right engine requesting a immediate reland. From inside the cabin, other passengers recorded the flames shooting out of the interior right engine, while Andrew Ames captured these images from the ground. Never seen something with flames like spewing out the back repetitively. I didn't want her to be all freaked out, but internally I was just like, oh my God, oh my God. Darlene Taylor says she didn't want to alarm her little girl, but she noticed flight attendants were visibly worried. The reactions from passengers were mixed depending on whether they could see out the right side windows. Some people were really panicking. Um, I'm seeing this to a lot of people. The plane doubled back to LAX, where all 347 passengers landed safely. <laughs> As for the Taylors, they were headed to Bali, but rebooking a flight to an exotic destination isn't so easy. It could be a lot worse. You know, there's people that are missing important things like weddings and other stuff. Uh, so we're missing two days of a long vacation. And tonight, the Taylors have checked into a hotel. Their flight has been rebooked for tomorrow evening, but this time around, they will have to take off from Ontario Airport, which is nearly 50 miles away. We're live at LAX, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News. Jeff.